I received this letter. I'd like to read it to you. Uh -huh. Dear Mike Marino, I am 43 years old and I'm trying desperately to lose weight. But the problem is, I'm a cake addict. I eat cake every day. I can't help it. After I eat a piece, I feel guilty and then vow to myself, I am not going to eat cake ever again. This is easier said than done. One hour goes by and I'm fine. Two hours go by, I start to crave, but stay strong. But by hour three, one cake gets eaten down, then two cakes, then three cakes. One day I ate 14 cakes. Please help. Can you tell me why I get these cravings? Sign, Geppetto. Look, I'm going to help. We've all been where you've been. Well, maybe not eating 14 cakes, that's absurd. But we've all had those times where we tried to cut something out of our diet and had a really hard time. Things like soda, burgers, ice cream, cookies, human blood. Uh, Okay, maybe that was just me. It was just a phase, don't judge me. We all need sugar to live. We need sugar for energy. Our cravings for that sugary food is a survival mechanism telling us when we need to seek out that sugary energy. Once upon a time, we got that sugary energy from fruit, but as technology evolved, we decided to capitalize on humans' natural cravings and started manufacturing sugar in mass quantities. This manufactured sugar is a lot more unhealthy than the natural sugars that you would find in fruit. The average person consumes an amount detrimental to their health. When your blood sugar is low, it sends a signal to your brain that says, hey, you have some uh, low blood sugar. Your brain searches its memory to see what solved that craving in the past. And your memory's like, cake solves this problem, go get some cake right now. You go to your cupboard, pull out that cake, scarf it down, and the craving goes away. So essentially, the cake is anchored in your brain as the cure to low blood sugar. So one day, you decide to go on a diet and cut out the cake. In place of the cake, you decide to eat an apple. Over the next day, you notice this is particularly difficult because every time you are hungry, you crave cake, not apples. Your cravings are anchored to cake, not apples. Here's the thing though, apples do solve the core issue. Apples do replenish your sugars and solve your low blood sugar issue and after eating one or two, your craving will go away. But what makes this particularly difficult is every time you have a low blood sugar craving, cake will pop into your mind. Be patient. Since apples and other fruits solve the core issue, a new anchor will start to form and you will start to develop apple cravings as well as your cake cravings. I'm not saying that these cake cravings will completely go away. You'll still probably have those cravings, but you'll probably have less of those cravings and start to develop more apple or fruit cravings as well, creating a stronger response in your brain. Once that stronger response and the connections in your brain develop, you will have a much easier time reaching for that healthier food. This is sort of a brain recalibration, if you will. This won't feel right at first. You will have to use a lot of inner strength and a lot of logic to fight your animal instincts, which will be very difficult because your animal instincts are there for your survival. So they will be a very strong force to fight up against. The problem in this case is that your animal instincts don't know the difference between synthesized and natural sugars. So in this case, you know better than your animal instincts and you have to use your logical side to resist the urges of the animal instinct. But with patience and persistence, this new anchor will form and you will have a lot easier time eating that healthy food. Your logical side and your animal instinct side will start to sync up and they will start working together. Brain body synchronization. Your body will look and feel better and you'll have a lot more energy. Your brain will be happier and work twice as fast with crystal clarity. 
let's face it, when you're eating junk food all the time, you get this bad case of mud brain. Do you have a problem? Are you looking for advice and need to ask me a question? Are you having trouble losing weight? Quitting smoking? With school? With your relationships? Reaching your goals? Or you just want my opinion or insight on a certain topic? Please leave me a comment or a video response or private message. Peace. Mike Marino videos. Ow. There we go. Click the link. Click the link. Come on guys, click the link. Come on. Click the link. Click the link. Come on guys, click the link. Click the link to watch my previous video. Click the link, click the link. Click the link, ink, 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 ink. Click the link, click the link.